Welcome back to the channel and today I'm gonna to be trying to fix a robot because the challenge right here is telling me to fix the bot This is a challenge made by horizon 25 um, And I really don't know what that entails as far as how to fix this bot But apparently we can only use the weld tool and the hammer uh, But before we get to fixing this bot I should probably address uh, for those of you who are more familiar with my channel why uh, my background looks a little bit different. The past couple of months have been really chaotic because I have recently moved into a new house and a new recording space. And today is the first day that I've managed to get everything set up and finally functional. So what you see behind me now is kind of stage one of my background. I will be adding to these shelves behind me as time goes on. So you will be seeing little things change here and there. So there's your brief explanation about why things in the face cam look a little bit different. Uh, I will add some more details if you guys stick around to the end of the video though but first we have a bot to fix so from what i can see uh there is a start button with wires and everything this thing is full of mods by the way wait a minute what we got these are like really realistic looking apples i'm sorry what do you hear that these are not no these are realistic looking apples and they are the opposite of realistic sounding apples I should probably stop hitting things. Okay, let's start the challenge. There we go. Challenge has started. Wait, what about the, the chest right here? Oh, no connection to the chest. Access denied here. So I'm assuming that this is the robot that we got to try to fix. He's even serving some uh, trademark drinks. And this seems to be having some issues right here. This, whatever this table is. These tables look kind of normal. Okay, well, nothing's on. Oh, I see now. The button got ripped out and it's causing some electrical issues. But this door opened, so we should probably go through the door, shouldn't we? Apparently, we got to repair. Whoa. Was I supposed to do that? What is this? This is so cryptic. Oh, no. No, wait, wait, wait. That is so cool. I don't know what just happened, but the longer I left this on, it started to burn. That is so cool. That's on the ground. I don't know what... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's also a four, five, six there. Um, did I see those numbers out here? This is six. Okay, this is five, three, two, one. Wait, I'm missing a four. That's not four. Oh, I don't know if I was supposed to do... I don't know if I was supposed to do that. Okay, does this mean anything? Or is this just kind of random? I think I was supposed to read some rules for the challenge really quick. Hold on. You are a troubleshooter and your mission is to put the robot server back into service in a fast food restaurant following an electrical problem at table number one. An intervention has already been made by the owner of the fast food restaurant, but it seems that the result is not convincing. You may have to solve the problems that come your way. Be careful. Damage to parts of the wall was also observed. What is behind these damaged parts? Don't a mason will intervene after your service to start repair work? Uh, I think it says, don't worry, a mason will intervene. So basically, if we destroy stuff, it's okay because someone's going to come in and fix it. All right. Well, uh, if that's the case, let's start hitting more things. Got a sensor that goes... Wait, oh, this sensor... Oh. Oh, I've done something. <gasps> I figured out the first thing. Okay, so now number one is good. Well, now that that electrical issue is gone, what happens if we do this? Hey. Oh, look at what's going on over here. So lights and energy is on. Okay, so let's turn that on. We can turn that on. Ah! Okay, let's uh, do some more destruction here. Oh, this is number four, the fridge. Okay, let's turn that on. All right, now the fridge is on. So now we have mug oh look at that okay we've made the coffee all right oh what kind of drink oh i guess it's tomato juice isn't it because it's a red container but i don't know if this means anything does this progress does it does this unlock something what does this have to do with fixing a bot okay this is new uh number five the drinks uh, have to be cold. Did I turn number five off? Number five is on. So this is kind. Oh. Oh. 
Weld. We need to fix this pipe. I need a pipe piece. All right, I don't know. Wait, oh, maybe if I put the coffee back in and then, oh. Three and seven, there's a seven? Whoa! What did I just do? What did I just do? What did I just do? What? No, did I just... What did I just do? This is a different place. Where am I? What? Where? Where? Have I just... Have I died? Have I Is that me? Is this my death scene? Have I teleported into my... Seeing my own death in the future? Okay, hold on. to use. Oh! Oh, what is happening? Are you? Oh! Is this... Is this the afterlife? Is this the afterlife? Hello? Hello? Hello, is this a maze? Am I in a maze right now? Oh, what's this? Use... Oh, I'm afraid... I'm using it. Hello? Oh! Oh, what's this? This is not what I was expecting out of this challenge. What is going on right now? What is going on right now? Bees? Okay, hold on. What is this? There is a passcode? There's a passcode in there? What? No, I died again or something? I don't know. I don't know what's happening. Okay, I go back through here. And then I click this, and then they, I go here, and then I go through. Wait, was I supposed to know the passcode? Am I supposed to know the pa- wait, where am I supposed to get the passcode from? Okay, hold on. I can't even- Code? Question mark? Yeah, that's what I'm- that's what I'm asking. I'm asking the questions here. Okay. Alright, well, press the button. Go back to my death scene. One, two, three. Yeah, everything's just broken here. Three, two, one. Six, five, four. I think it's like a four-digit passcode. Maybe somewhere around here is a hint to the passcode. I can't... I don't see a way... Oh! <gasps> oh, one, two. Oh, one, two. Oh, I just go this way. I don't have to press that green button. The other green button. All right. Oh, one, two. Oh. Oh, one, two, three digit passcode. Okay. And enter. Okay, that's pretty cool. What is this challenge? Uh, uh, check, check, check. Ah! I don't understand. Hold on. Alright. Oh, turn off the electricity. They're studying me, like, does this- can this person- is this person smart enough to figure out what has to happen here? Okay, so clearly, like, I have to fill that in, right? But, and in what way? In what way does this get accomplished? Um... Oh, no, don't press the button. Don't press that button. Okay. Alright, well, the good news is, I think this door's already unlocked. That allows this to turn on the electricity, so with that off, nothing happens. When I do it with the electricity on... Okay, that's not- Oh, change? I don't know if I was supposed to do this. I don't think I was supposed to do this. This was, um, a temperature icon. All right, let's just remember that that was like one of the, the it was like the cold thing. I think this turns on the freezer, not the freezer, but the, the refrigerator for all the drinks. Okay, I'm not sure if I did anything there. It didn't seem like it. Maybe there's another place to go in here. Nice. What? I've just teleported back. What happened? Okay, here we are. We're back here. We open this. 193? It's a different code now? 193? Was that what it is? 193? Wait, now two door- Only one of these lit up last time, didn't it? Or was it both and I was only looking at one? Oh, that's creepy. That is so creepy. That is really creepy. Okay. Oh, I don't understand. I don't understand. What do you want from me? Okay, so now... Aha! Here we go. Here we go. So I weld that. 
Ah! I just died because I didn't turn the electricity off before I did that. I cannot believe this. Okay. Wait, what? How did it fill back in? How did it do that? How is there? These mods are beyond my understanding. I just restarted this challenge somehow. All right, well, that's fine. Um, so yeah, now this is still doing that. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, I gotta break the glass. Zero, one, six. Zero, one, six. Okay, turn that off. Still an X. Oh, I don't know. All right, here we go. So now, there should be one more pipe left. Oh, no, 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 don't wanna do it yet. I wanna turn off number five. Turn the power off to number five. Okay, so now, with the pipe left, I survived, and now I turn on number five. And now the blue light is on. Here we go. Progress. Now I can hit that. Okay. Does this serve a purpose? This ice? Oh, it does serve a purpose. Now where am I? Where am I now? I'm in like a shower or like a weird sink? Uh. Leon Frost. Who is this? I mean, it's Leon Frost. What? Look at this gaming setup. What are you doing? Keep calm and play in the scrap mechanic. I love playing the scrap mechanic. That's why they call me the scrap man. This guy is having the time of his life. Look at this. Wait, what are you watching? Oh, that's just the outside. So I'm gonna push this button. Access granted. To what? Hello, dude. How's it going, my dude? What are you up to, my dude? Access granted. I don't... Oh, slurp? Maybe. Oh, did I miss a message? The boss removed. The... I will try to... Reboot laser? What laser? Protect pinata. Oh. Uh, uh, do I gotta... I killed the bot. Was I supposed to kill the bot? Oh! Oh! I can't move! I've been dragged into the laser. What's happening to me? Oh. Okay. I don't know what happened. There's like a down arrow here now. Use the own- Use only the defense function of your hammer. Okay. Come back later. Heh. <laughs> Called it. Okay. Use only the defense function. Okay. What does it do though? Oh. Now it says something over here. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Use only the defense function of my hammer. Okay. Do I press this? Ah! Did I lose? I know what I'm doing now. I was waiting. I did miss all this stuff. For you, some troubles with the spot six. Oh, that was helpful. Okay, so yeah, we got all this. I have to defend the piñata. All right, I'm using my block tool this time. I'm not going to I'm not going to destroy the bot this time cuz he's going to activate the laser, right? There we go. Laser activated again. So now the bot can't move anymore. And now, well done. I got a well done. You save piñata. So I may have failed by killing the bot from her pet toy. I'm sure the battery is missing. I will show you the way to find this battery. Uh, there is color code to activate. Okay, what's the color code? You forgot, you forgot the color code. You forgot it, of course you forgot the color code. Good luck, just good luck. Beware mouses, you mean mice? In electricity room. Now I go this way, is it gonna be different this time? Now there's something in the green area. So I lost before by killing the bot. Are these the... M <laughs> That's funny. Forward. There we go. Oh, I can't get through here. Oh, okay. Nothing happens. Y equals negative two. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, well, this is, this is fantastic. Zero. Up arrow plus Y, right arrow plus X. All right, this one, oh, X plus Y equals two, but like, uh, I don't I, I don't understand what I'm solving for here. Oh, right and 
up. So if we start there, but no, that doesn't make any sense. We can't go up anymore from the, uh, oh my goodness, these, these mice. So X must be four, because that'd be four minus two equals two. So what happens if I just press one of these? I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. So what, maybe this is, okay, maybe this is the coordinate. So negative two, so if we start there, we go negative two and then plus four. One, two, three, four. Oh. I figured it out. What is that? Do I have to do it again? Okay. I figured it out. That's not a, I mean, it kind of was a color code, but it was a single color. All right, we're back. We did something different. Oh, wait, access granted. Oh. Oh. Ah! Oh no, now what? I'm just gonna push the button. 1337 was the code. Okay, what is this? Did I win? Oh wait, there's a button. <gasps> Did I win? Oh my goodness, that was so cool. Oh, okay, there he goes. He's going back now. I did it! He's functional! Yay! I am the best! Congratulations! I am the best! That was an insanely weird and unexpected way of doing a challenge. Like, the whole... The, the light room sequence and like the... Alright, can I get this thing to be quiet, please? Alright, hold on. I'm gonna have to... I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to make the challenge. Yeah, like the whole like explosion death scene going into like a light room, like weird vision or memory or something. I don't know what that was all about. And then things changing and like welding stuff. It was... It was a... I, it was a challenge unlike anything I've done before. So kudos to Horizon for building something like this. I have no idea how most of these mods even work. I will leave a link to this creation down in the description below if you guys want to play around with it yourself and take it apart and see how it works or just try to speed run it or something. But for those of you who lasted this long in the video, a little bit more detail about uh, what's going on with the move and stuff like that. As you can see, um, I'm finally up and recording in my new office space and I love my new office space so far, but it is not 100% done yet. Uh, you will see these, these shelves behind me will slowly start changing as they accumulate some more uh stuff and gear and like toys and little trinkets so if you're a dedicated viewer of the channel see if you can spot something new every couple of videos or so i do plan on doing an actual dedicated office tour video that shows you what everything looks like around me because there's a lot of space around part of the office that goes over here there's another part of the office that goes over here a little bit but I still got a few more details to work out before it's ready for the official office tour, but I am looking forward to showing you guys as soon as I can. I still have a really busy couple of weeks ahead of me. We're trying to unpack. I have family visiting in town, so you may there may still be some spotty videos here and there. And another big announcement, uh, some of my videos, a couple of my videos so far have actually been edited by not me for the first time ever in my six years doing YouTube. With all the craziness going on with the moving and the remodeling and getting everything set up and all this, I've had way less time than normal to fit in recording and editing everything myself. So to prevent myself from just completely burning out with zero time to do anything, I decided to experiment with seeing what it's like to have an editor. This video was not edited by the editor, but you'll probably see a little bit of differences in the editing style um, as the videos come out. So hopefully that's going to allow me to free up a little bit more time for myself and just keep a little bit more sanity than I've been uh, keeping lately. So I think that pretty much covers the updates that I wanted to fill you guys in on. Uh, thanks for sticking around to this point in the video. Hoping to get back to the more consistent releases soon. Um, anyway, if you enjoyed this video, you'll probably enjoy some more that you can find on the channel right here on the end screen. Hope this video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.